Spokane police are investigating an 11-year-old's claim that he was robbed on the way to school this morning. The student says he was mugged as he walked along 2nd Avenue near 4th Street about 845. The victim, who was cut in the scuffle with the suspect, then ran to Sheridan Elementary, reported the incident. KXLY 4's Jeff Humphrey is live at the scene. Jeff, the boy says the adult tried to stab him? And that's one reason why police are so concerned about this incident. Not only someone who would target a kid for a holdup, but then try to hurt the kid instead of just making a getaway. The fifth grade victim is a regular customer at Tesoro where he gets stops and gets some breakfast during his eight block walk to school. However, this morning, just as he about to get into the convenience store parking lot, an adult stopped him in his tracks. Just prior to getting to the store, he took his wallet out and wanted to see how much money he had to see what he could get at the store. And this male approached him and punched him in the head, took his wallet, took his keys, and then uh, actually took out a knife and tried to stab the boy. Well, fortunately, this Sheridan Elementary School student was fed up with being victimized, and he was able actually to block that jab with his hand. He avoided getting stabbed, but still suffered a small cut on the inside of his palm. He then ran all the way to Sheridan Elementary, where he reported the crime. Arriving officers interviewed him and found his story was very consistent. And so now he describes his attacker as a white male about 19 years old, with scruffy brown hair, last seen wearing a dark color jacket. Reporting live in Southeast Spokane, Jeff Humphrey, KXLY4.